Hello, my name is Daya Jagere. Welcome back again. This is our uh, Luminous YouTube channel. This is the property I did a tour of a few uh, episodes ago. So right now, uh, the contractor is already here. We just bought this property last week, Friday. We closed on Friday, and uh, today is Tuesday. Uh, I was supposed to come on Monday, but before I knew it, my contractor has probably done almost <laughs> one quarter of the job already. But uh, I won't be able to show you what it used to look like, except I'll probably share some pictures. like then you will see that a lot of work has been done I'll take you inside show you what is going on it's a two bedroom two baths and I want to make this a quick flip so follow me let me show you what it looks like I'll show you uh, from the property work through the demolition right now then the renovation phase then you know the final presentation what is going on all right so this is a three bedroom two bath property it was built in 2013 like I said we are in uh, South Dallas oh and by the way I'm recording by myself today my wife is not here so that's why I'm doing the walkthrough by myself. So, um, one of the things we are going to work on, which I will be able to show you as we get along is, in order to make this house more secured, we are going to put a gate right here. Uh, on both ends of the house, we plan to put a gate. The house is really good, the brick is clean, the roof is uh, very, very good. Uh, though there is a little bit of a hole somewhere at the top of the roof, which we are going to fix. Uh, we got this house for um how much was it we bought the house for 177,000. so the estimates uh, so this is this uh, other side of the house where we are going to install a gate to make sure that both houses are secured by the time i'm done with the inside i'll take you to the uh, uh to the outside of the house so like i was saying about the price let me uh talk about the price a little bit before i go into the property we bought the property for 177,000. we estimate to fix it with uh I think 23,000 with miscellaneous and everything we are estimating somewhere in the 204 205,000 to finish the project so I'll let you know I'll probably put the details of the cost as we get along okay so you might hear some noise on the inside like I said I promised to share some before pictures so that you understand what the property used to look like because already the contractors are working so you might not be able to see what it used to look like and what it is right now uh, when we bought the property, it was a little bit dirty, very dirty. Uh, last week on Saturday, my contractor put it on Facebook for people to come and you know pick whatever they want. That was the easiest way for us to clear everything in the house. So the house is empty right now. They started working. All right. Um, sorry, I need to do a quick recording. Okay. Yeah, but just you can continue working, but just the noise. Okay. All right. So here we have. This is the living room. Um, the, ta the flooring used to be tiles, but we've taken out all the tiles. The goal is to put vinyl clay all over the house. Though, we are going to leave the uh, tiles that is in the kitchen. That is why you see that everything is covered. So, but in the, in, the, in the living room, in the bedrooms, we are going to change all the floorings to vinyl clay. Um, this is the slab. This is the slab for the kitchen area. As you can see what is going on in the kitchen area right now. The kitchen area, we are going to have a projection to make it look more like an open concept where we're going to put uh, chairs for people to sit down and they can easily see the living room from the kitchen. So, uh, let me take you through the master bedroom. This is the master bedroom. Uh, like I said, it's a three bedroom. The master bedroom has its own baths. Uh, everything is currently cleared out. So it might be a little bit hard to appreciate what it used to look like. We are going to retain the ceiling fan. That's why it's covered right now. Um, so this is the size of the master bedroom. And grandpa is here. Grandpa, you want to say hello? Hello. <laughs> All right. All right. So that's my dad. Yeah, he's, he, he's here with us. You know, my dad he used to be a building contractor. So he knows everything we are doing right now. Technically, I'm inheriting what he taught me growing up. So, this is the 
uh, master uh, bedroom and we have the master bath. So for the master bath, the goal is to uh, take care of the cabinet, clean it out, change it totally. We are going to change the wall. This is the bathroom. Uh, we are going to, I think this is, this is actually a new uh, bathtub that was just replaced. Like I said, they started work on Monday and they've done a lot. Uh, I should have come yesterday to come and do the initial recording, but it looks like they are moving very fast. The master uh, bathroom, everything is going to be cleaned out, the lightning, everything is going to be changed. This is the closet for the master. Uh, we are going to clean out all this place, add some more shelves, uh, clean it up, make it look good, change the lighting right there. Alright, so here we are in the kitchen area before we go into the uh, bedrooms. So in the kitchen area, the cabinet is going to be cleaned out. The cabinet is going to be painted gray. We're going to make some changes right here. Like I said, we're going to put the quartz for the uh, granite uh, to make the kitchen area look very good. Uh, we're going to, we, we will add undo to the cabinet, change everything, add some electronics right here. Uh, the cooktop, the cooktop and the dishwasher. The dishwasher is going to be in this area while the cooktop is going to be in this area and uh, this is where you have the refrigerator so the, uh, we don't provide the refrigerator but there's going to be a space for that in the house then also this is where you have the laundry this is the laundry slash no this is just the laundry this is the water heater uh, for the property now this is the laundry the laundry is quite big we're going to make sure it looks good it's just going to be uh, a very small small fix change the painting change the lightning you know clean up everywhere change the flooring uh, this is the pantry it has a very big pantry so the goal is to make sure that the pantry is also looking good so you have the pantry next to uh, the laundry room all right so while we are at it let me show you uh, like i said it's a three bedroom two baths we right now i'm walking into uh, the bathroom and but on my left you have the bath the bedroom three and right here, straight ahead of me, you have bedroom two. So let me show you what uh, the bathroom looks like. As you can see, work is going on right now. There's so much, I can't believe they've done a lot in one day. So <laughs> between yesterday and today, these guys have been hard at work. They are actually on break right now. So this is the bathroom. Um, not so much we're gonna do here. We we'll change the bathtub, clean out everywhere, change the toilets, uh, change the faucets uh, right there. Uh, we're just going to clean out the cabinet. We're not going to make any big changes. The mirror, we'll leave the mirror, but we're going to put a trim right here to make sure that it looks good and it's more modern. We're also going to change the lighting to bring it back to life. So I'm looking forward to what all this is going to look like. Um, I think they already, well, they didn't make any painting. But yeah, so that is, the, that is what the bathroom looks like. Uh, not so much crazy we have going on there. And uh, the bathroom, the bathroom too, Connect straight to bathroom one, the master bath. If you can see right there, you see there's a small hole that connects the two. So on the other side is actually the master bath. All right. Moving forward, we have the bedroom two. The bedroom two is all clean out. Uh, as you can see, this is the bathtub that they bought for the uh, bathroom two, for the bathtub for the bathroom for the bathroom two. Yep, this is what. The bedroom too looks like it's quite um, not that big but it's just moderate enough the total square foot for the house is i think 1200 or thereabouts so it's just moderate for a family of four or five to live in for a three bedroom two bath um yeah we are going to retain the ceiling fan that's why we have them all covered up this is the closet this is the closet for the uh, bedroom too this is what it looks like so all right, I'm standing on the other side uh, of the bedroom too. So there you go. All right, moving on. Let me show you what bedroom three looks like. So this is bedroom three. Bedroom three is also around the same size as bedroom two. Like I said, the ceiling fan is covered. The plan is to just clean it out, change some lightning, make it look good. Not so much uh, changes. And this right here is the closet. So the closet is actually big, I like it. I like, I like the closet, it's very big. So we, the plan is to 
We'll put some lightning here. So there's actually light right here. But the goal is we're gonna make sure it looks good, it's clean. Make some little changes. As you can see the floor, the floor has been ripped out. Um, we're changing the floor totally. We're gonna make sure everything is looking good. All the way to the bathroom, all the way to the uh, other uh, bedroom. Putting a uh, vinyl click in all the flooring to make it look good. All right, here you are. I'm walking out right now from the house and this is the uh, backyard. This is the outside. That is the AC. As you can see, it's gated. <laughs> so, this is what it looks like from the outside. If you can see, it's very, very big. Uh, we'll cut the lawn, make it look good, make everything more presentable. And uh, like I said, it's not so much going on right there. That is why we are definitely shooting for 30 days to get the project done. I'm, I'm walking to the, to the end of the, of the property so I can show you what it looks like from the other side. All right. Okay, there you have it. So this is it. This is what the property looks like. It's a quite modern, it's very clean. It's a good looking house. We just have to clean it out, bring it up to standard. A little fixes here and there, and this property will be ready to rock and roll on the market. So, um, estimate is, uh, we're hoping, you know, by the time we're done, 177 purchase price, um, fixing it like 23,000, that brings us to 200 or thereabout. Everything's like, uh, you know, with miscellaneous, maybe 200, 204. And I'm hoping that by the time it is the market, we are looking at in the 240, 260 range for us to close it out. Okay, let me know what you think about this. I'll see you next week uh, by the time we are coming for the renovation. Thank you. All right, thank you so much. That's about it for the week one. I was able to quickly show you what it looks like. Uh, I'll add some pictures either at the beginning of this program or maybe you know, uh, just let to see what it used to look like. Uh, let's see how it goes. Uh, today, is, uh, <laughs> today is day two actually of the project start. But let's see what we can do you know, in the next uh, 28 days. I'll let you know how it goes. See you next week. Thank you. Hello and welcome back. My name is Dara Jagere once again and I am here in the Dallas property, South Dallas. The one I told you we were going to be fixing within 30 days. Uh, I'm inside the building already and my contractor and our team, they've actually done an amazing job. Uh, this is week two, funny enough, and she's done. So I know I said that we're going to do it in um, 30 days, but uh, last week I was here, this is my this is second week and work has been done. By the end of this week, by Saturday, we're going to be closing out this project. So instead of 30 days, I'm going to change the title to 21 or 14 days, something more interesting. But to be honest with you, I'm really, uh, I'm glad I found a good one. I'm glad things are going as planned. So I'm going to show you around. The work is almost done. By the time I come next week, you should probably see the whole project being done. So let me just walk you around the building, show you what has been done so far. You'll probably see my contract, you see my contractor and my team doing a little bit fixes here and there. And once I'm done here, I'll take you to the uh, other property in Gala. That one's gonna take a little bit of a time. So the renovation is going on consistently over there. So join me as I walk through this. So let me show you around the house. Uh, thank you so much. All right, so here we are in the property. Uh, if you remember, this is a South Dallas property. The contractor is really busy uh, working. One thing I wanted to show on the outside is just the gates. By the end of this week, we're gonna have gates on both sides, the left and the right, to prevent access into the property anyhow, and uh, also improve the security. Uh, that will help us. By the end of this week, we are also gonna cut the grass, make sure the grass is looking good before we take pictures and list it on uh, the MLS for us to uh, sell. Um, coming into the property itself, look at the floor. The, the, you know, if you remember, the floor was a carpet and some tiles, but we've changed everything to uh, vinyl all the way down to the bedrooms. The bedrooms, the carpets, uh, the bedroom, all the two, the three bedrooms and the living room, they've been changed to uh, vinyl. Uh, as you can see, some work is going on right there. This is the master bedroom. As you can see, everything looks uh, clean and going on, what is going on here. We've changed all the flooring, painting uh, on the wall. We use a gray painting. This is uh, for the toilets. Uh, that's the um, uh, toilet sink. Uh, also, this is a... Uh, so, by the way, there might not be some light because of the water that is going on. So you might see some dark places. But, as you can see, the bathroom has been renovated. 
from what we did uh, last week. Uh, the, uh, the bathroom shower, everything, has been, uh, the tub has been replaced and the painting is still going on. The, also the cabinet that has been cleaned up, cleaned out. The handles are going to be added, the lightning, and someone is definitely busy working in the, um, right there in the closet for the uh, master. So, what is going on right there? I'll definitely do a detailed walkthrough when I come back next week. That by that time, we'll have all the recordings, we'll have this property ready to be listed. Now, this is the kitchen area. The kitchen area has the tiles. We left the tiles the way it was. All we have to do is just to clean it, we buff it, and the tiles will be back to normal. This is the kitchen area. Uh, look at the kitchen area. All the uh, cabinet has been painted gray. That was the color we decided to choose. I like the light that is already installed. Also, this is for the dining area. We have this uh, chandelier light that will be uh, installed uh, right here. Um, as you can see, that is the pantry. What is going on around the pantry area? Then we also have the uh, laundry area. Right in the laundry area, we also have the uh, electric uh, water heater. So, um, like I said, what is still going on here? This is week two, but we are almost done. Like things move so fast right here, I can't even believe it myself. Uh, the kitchen area is a little bit messy. So what? So much work going on left and right. That is the cooktop that is going to be added there. Uh, also, that is the uh, what's it called? That is for the dishwasher. So the dishwasher and the cooktop is going to be an electric cooktop, as you can see. It's a plus one. So you just want to make sure that everything goes in the right way. All right, moving into the uh, bedrooms. So two bedrooms are here. Two bedroom, one bath on this side. The master has one bedroom, one bath. So that makes it three bedroom, two baths. Okay, so this is the hallway, a little bit of hallway to the bathroom. Let me show you what's going on in the bathroom. I have people working here, so can't do too much here. But as you can see, you know, the bathroom is already being cleaned up. Everything is uh, going as expected from what I talk. They've changed the lighting. So the light in the bathroom is really good. I like that. Let me see myself. Hello, everybody. All right, that's me. <laughs> so work is going on here on the ground. Everything is uh, getting changed out. Uh, by this weekend, what is going to be done here? Now, the floor that leads to the bathroom is also still in tiles. We're going to buff it, make it clean. But this is the bedroom one. If you remember last week, there was like a, uh, a big uh, space right there that the, the, uh, the roof needs to be uh, fixed up. So, we've already done that. And up in the roof also, we fix all the uh, roofing issues. The floor, what do you think about the floor? I think the vernal is really, really good. The color matches with the color of the house, which is gray. It's, it, it makes it pop, pops out. This is the closet. This is the closet for the room one. So, uh, quite simple, not so much work needs to be done. All the doors are painted white. Now, this is the other one. Same thing. Uh, the flooring, vinyl. This is the closet. Closet is looking great. So, like I said, it was just a small fix that needs to be done here and there. So, the lights will be fixed. As you can see, that is already taken out. So, we're going to fix that, make sure everything looks good. Uh, the windows will be cleaned out. Uh, I'm pretty sure by the time I come here next week, uh, we should have a fully uh, ready uh, for, for a property that is good for a family of maybe three, four, five, or six. So, yeah, not so much uh, size. The property is, I think, 1,200 square foot. Let me show you what the outside looks like quickly. Uh, not so much has been done here. Yeah, everything is still full of grass. Uh, the goal is to clean it up by the end of this week. So the fence will be added on both sides. This is the left and that is the right side. Everything else is looking good. The roof for the property is good. And I like all the trees uh, at the back. It makes it easy for you know a family with a large kids to come out here and play so that's what we have here today not so much by next week i'll show you what it looks like i'll share pictures of the finished product and we'll see how it goes so rehab deal that i'm working on let me know what you think and uh stay tuned for the final product thank you